Hi, my name is D Marcus. All right. Um, start riding BMX probably like uh, 18 years ago, maybe a little bit more than that. I had early on influences such as uh, Ryan Nyquist. Before I even picked up a bike, I would always watch all the X Games and he stood out to me. I think Haro had like a BMX contest at the unit. I remember seeing JJ and he had like a, a hybrid style of riding. Brought like his street influence also mixed with park tech stuff. And I was like, wow, like, this guy's amazing. Watching Nyquist do bar spins and then seeing JJ do them. Funny thing, he was doing bar spins with the gyro and with the brake lever. And I remember having a gyro and a brake lever and I made myself learn how to do a bar spin without grabbing a brake lever. Watching him ride street that way and doing all the stuff he did with the gyro, with the, with the brake and all that stuff. And it was like, you still can do those things regardless of how your bike is set up. Looking at all the different things he did and like later on the props, his props bio he can ride everything. You know, he can ride a flat road, he can ride flat ground, he can ride a skate park, he can ride dirt jumps and doing tail whips in the streets. That has always stood out to me and that's why he is like, will always be one of my favorite riders. No one would really be able to forget his deadline section. You see the transition of like how he was when he was a lot younger to that current moment. Being in San Diego and being around him and getting to ride with him often has really put a lot of things in perspective, not only just because of his lifestyle, whether it's like not drinking or not eating certain foods because he wants to be healthier. Well, if you can have discipline in what you eat, then you can have discipline in what you say to people, how you treat people and how you treat situations. So I feel like that kind of helped me look at myself a, a little bit differently and have like a, a little bit more respect for myself and the people around me. Sometimes when kids reach out to me, how important it is to respond to them or to talk with them about BMS because I, didn't, I wasn't able to talk to JJ over like the internet or anything because of the time period. Never hesitate to express how you feel about it, but make sure that you're, you're kind to other people and kind to situations and you do it genuinely for yourself before you do it for anybody else.